Hi guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how to find the surface area and the volume of cubes. So a cube is a box where the length, the width, and the height are the same. And because of that, each side of a cube is a square. Now, to calculate the surface area of a cube, we need to count all of the sides of a cube and then find the total area. Okay? And so how many sides are there in a cube? Well, there is one, two, three, four, five, and six. There are six squares in a cube. Now, what is the area of one square? If you watched my previous video, you know that the area of one square is S to the power of 2. And since there are 6 sides or 6 squares, the surface area is 6 times s to the power of 2. So let's say the length, the width, and the height are 8 centimeters. What is the surface area of this cube? Well, we know that 8 is s, and 8 to the power of 2 is 64. Now, 64 times 6 is equal to 384 centimeters squared. And so the surface area is 384 centimeters squared. How do we calculate the volume of a cube? The formula to calculate the volume is S times S times S, which is the same thing as S to the power of 3. Now, I'm going to explain where this formula comes from, but for now, let's use this formula. If each side is 8 centimeters, then the volume is 8 to the power of 3, which is 512 centimeters to the power of 3. And so the volume of this cube is 512 centimeters to the power of 3. If we have a cube with the side of 2 for each, then the volume is 2 to the power of 3, which is 8. Now, where does the volume formula come from? Well, let's imagine if we have a unit cube, and a unit cube is basically a cube where each side is 1. How many unit cubes can we fill this big cube? Well, let's count together. So we can put in 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and 8, which is the same number as the volume. So whenever you have a cube and you want to find the volume, you can either put these little cubes inside the cube, or you can just take the three sides and multiply it together and then you will get the volume. Now it's your turn. Go ahead and find the surface area and the volume of this cube. And so the length, the width, and the height of this cube is 5 centimeters. That is it for today. I hope you guys learned something new. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you do, please click the like button and also don't forget to hit the subscribe button for more videos like this. With that being said, I hope you have a good day and I will see you guys in the next video.